بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم in the name of Allah the most merciful the most beneficent assalamu alaikum dear viewers i hope all of you are fine with the grace and mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala welcome to my channel exploring survey you can follow me on twitter and blogspot.com in this short video clip i will discuss on the use of punctuation marks in english here six important punctuation marks like full stop question mark comma exclamation mark quotation mark apostrophe will be discussed so let's get started full stop the full stop or period is a punctuation mark it is used for several purposes most often to mark the end of a declarative sentence such as the cat is black full stop my uncle in a, is an honest man full stop when to use a full stop number one at the end of a sentence my name is Tarsin and I am a doctor full stop he went to the market full stop number two at the end of command like open the door full stop do the work full stop number three after abbreviation for instance prf dot for professor a full stop m for anti meridian p full stop m for post meridian and b full stop b full stop c for british broadcasting corporation st dot for state mr dot for mister now comma you know comma is the most useful and common punctuation mark in english a comma indicates a smaller break or sub pause it is used to separate words clauses or ideas within a sentence such as c comma listen and be silent and you will live in peace he was tall comma dark and handsome when to use comma number one to separate a series of words like he wanted some cakes comma candies and cookies i like mango comma banana comma orange and jackfruit number two to separate a series of phrases such as i like reading books comma listening to music comma watching tv and studying english number three to set off introductory phrases or clauses such as having finally arrived in town comma we went shopping number four after certain words that introduce a sentence such as well comma i am not going home on foot yes comma i will be there so you can see that after well and yes we put comma number five to separate coordinate adjective such as followers feel energetic comma confident and happy number six to separate the quoted parts like he asked comma do you want to go with me number seven to separate dates years and address such as we'll meet on friday comma july 15 i was born in september 17 comma 1980 number eight to separate a statement from a tag question such as there aren't any problems comma were there we have never seen that comma have we now question or interrogation mark a question mark is placed at the end of a sentence or phrase to indicate a direct question the question mark is also called an interrogation point or note of interrogation such as have you had your breakfast question mark where are you going question mark how are you question mark when to use question mark number one to end our direct question like how often do you go to masjid question mark do you like it question mark number two to end our tag question is very good comma isn't he question mark we have never seen him comma have we question mark number three in a series of question is it good in form question mark style question mark meaning question mark that means is it good in form style meaning exclamation mark the exclamation mark is used to express strong feelings or some emotion positive or negative such as what a gorgeous house exclamation mark how beautiful the bird is exclamation mark when to use exclamation mark number one to express strong feelings or emotions such as how interesting the book is exclamation mark the meal was so good exclamation mark number two to give a strong command like sit down exclamation mark 
stop exclamation mark an apostrophe indicates position it has three uses contraction plurals and possessive such as i'm not going there that means i am not going there so we write i apostrophe am that means i am ahmed's book when to use apostrophe number one to show contraction of words it's raining outside that means it is raining outside i'll be there soon that means i will so i will we write in contracted form like i apostrophe double l so that i will be there soon number two to form possessive nouns that means this is tasin's book this means the book belongs to tasin tasbia's house is nice number three to form plural words the company's management must tackle this so here the companies singular form is company plural form is company so we put apostrophe after s the girl's idea was accepted so girl is singular form girls is plural form so we put apostrophe after s that means girls so the girl's idea was accepted quotation marks the primary function of quotation marks is to represent exact language either spoken or written that has come from somebody else Such as Aisha said, comma, quotation mark start. I really hate when it is hot outside. Quotation mark finish. One more example. Quotation mark starts. Do the homework carefully. Comma, quotation mark finish said the teacher. When to use quotation marks? Number one, to show space on writing by someone else or character. Such as Taskia said, comma, quotation mark start, I didn't mean to break the window, full stop, quotation mark finish. One more example, Russell said, comma, quotation mark start, why cannot we leave the place now, question mark, then quotation mark finish. Thank you all everyone, thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please subscribe my channel and share it with your friends.